Well, rise and shine campus. We are up here live at Kilauea. <clears throat> Good morning and welcome. We're still dialing in a few things. Thank you all for joining us. <clears throat> Excuse me. We are two pineapples, Lou and Anna, live at Hawaii Volcanoes National Park. We took the short walk over to Waldron's Ledge. <laughs> <laughs> to uh, go live tonight. We have some cool things to announce, at least one of them, and I'm gonna run it right now because we've all been waiting for a month. Let's see if I can find it here. There we go. We have an official update. Mm -hmm. Woo! Mm -hmm. Cue applause. No. <laughs> <laughs> we've seen a 20 foot jump in the last 30-ish days which is pretty remarkable considering the size of this caldera. If you guys had a chance, uh, we posted it on this and everywhere else we could. Yesterday, Hawaii Pod had their show. Went over quite a bit of detail, which was kind of nice, at the, especially covering the drop-down blocks, where it's headed, what it has to actually accomplish to get there. Uh, a lot happened. I'm sure that link is still up there somewhere. If not, we'll drop it again. I see we have a lot of you checking in already. And we saw Sneesaw. Aloha Sneesaw. Came a member. Thank you so much. Very, very Sneesaw's been with us since uh, mm -hmm. whew, almost, almost two years, I think, huh? So thank you so much. Uh, we appreciate all your members. I'm going to go through here real quick, take a look. I see uh, our hermano in España. Our mods are up. Thank you, Aurelio. Doc Fox has checked in. Thanks for dropping the link. Good morning, Don. Doc Fox, we have troops set out for pumper trucks this morning. We got to conserve. We need all we can get. It's getting a little sketchy around here. We need to fill this bowl. Saw so Hermione came in. Oh, Hermione, did you get the other eye done yet? Hope you healed up pretty good. Nightbot is on a mission tonight. I can feel it already. <laughs> good morning, Stephen. Mark's up early. Bonjour, Agrippine. So here we are, live at Kilauea. I gotta put my glasses on because I see one camera is already a little fuzzy on me. A lot, pretty low light down there. You know, we're we're sitting at Walden's Ledge, 
Oh, I did it again. <laughs> oh, I practiced so many times too. That uh, the, there's really not that much uh, light coming from the the pit itself, which is never any fun when you're trying to get the cameras focused in down there. I don't know if it's me or what, but I'm gonna switch over there real quick and that way we can see what's going on while I die in a, die on another camera. One eye is okay, number two, October 10th. Ah. I made the uh, ultimate mistake this morning walking out. I forgot my coffee in the truck and I'm not walking back to get it. So, like everybody has already probably already mentioned, hit that thumbs up. I saw Anna drop that as a reminder. Share us out if you have that opportunity. We appreciate that. Anything to boost the algorithms. If you're catching us on a replay, go ahead and uh, leave us a comment. Good morning, Gary. See, uh-oh, reminder to self. No autofocus. Well, there we go. So where was I? Hit the thumbs up, like, subscribe, share us out, help us boost that algorithm. We didn't get our uh, midweek stream in. We like to get in usually Tuesday, Wednesday, um, somewhere. You guys know that. Sunday is definitely our day, but somewhere in the middle so we can... Uh, stay up with everything we just got busy with chores at the house send the other pineapple she can get it doc she's dragging her heels this morning <laughs> we uh we had a busy week of finishing up some drywall all the texture work she's not a she's not quite a hundred percent right now i gotta wait for her coffee to kick in So let's go over some numbers, shall we? We have uh, the normal earthquake activity around here. Although we did have a three, didn't we, yesterday? Yeah, 3.0. 3.0. It was during the flood show. Yeah, during the show yesterday, huh? A little bit earlier than that. So if you haven't heard or you're not reading down below, the overflow measurements from September 12th indicated that the crater floor has seen a total rise of 143 meters. It's 469 feet for those of you that speak English. And it's 111 million cubic meters, 29.2 billion gallons of lava have been effused since the beginning of this eruption. So that puts us at a at a 20 foot rise and uh, four, well, I think it was four billion gallons. I think we've been at 25, 27. 27, so two billion gallon increase. Hey Jen, good morning. Hanging the drywall is not the, the, the real pain. It's the taping and mudding. If you guys ever, and what? Sanding. And the sanding. You know, that, that is one job I, I, we don't all give them credit for, those guys that do that. They make it look easy. I make it, I make it look bad. <laughs> so no unusual activity has been noted along the East Rift Zone. Summit tilts recorded uh, minor deflation. Uh, in case uh, nobody's brought this up, yes, Kilauea is erupting and has been. We're coming up on the one year anniversary of this eruption. SO2 levels are sitting at 
1300 so pretty much where she's always sitting nothing too crazy going on earthquakes are earthquakes just another day here on the island Yeah, Mark, being uh, being under six foot doesn't help up and down the ladder for me. Stephen Carter, good morning. Corner beads, oh, yeah. But that's the life of uh, what I always like to say is a uh, DIYer. Did I get that right? No. <laughs> <laughs> but we can handle a few flaws here and there doing it ourselves. No biggie. You can see this, uh, I'm gonna switch over to this camera here. That lower left corner of the bowl is just kinda relaxing. Any much, we see in some gas pickup here and there, but not doing a lot yet. But we'll keep an eye on it. I'm gonna move that up to the top screen there. Oh, Jen, you bring up something uh, very important. I'm not a big believer that everything is need to be square and plumb and level. I think that's all overrated. <laughs> Aurelio, two I's, two D's. Welcome to the Hawaiian Handyman Channel. <laughs> Don't call me for repairs. <laughs> what texture did you do? I did a drop, a knockdown. I like a nice texture on the wall. Good morning, dude. Good morning, Tanya. Says, uh, love y'all's dedication and work. Never stop. Thank you so much for the support. Nope. We try not to stop, but life always catches up to everybody at one point or another. Ms. L, good morning. See, we got a little activity in that corner. We got lenses stretched out four feet here. Trying to uh, reach down, we're sitting uh, two miles plus back. Even with the uh, the rise in the in the caldera, it's not easy getting the lens down there. She's a filling, dude. She's a filling. She's taking her time. Still feel like a zombie. I'm still zombified. Yeah. <laughs> 
haven't fully waken up yet. playing the game of uh, focus camera this morning. What's going on here? So I'm just pull back and uh, sit on this one camera here till we get some gas bubbles going, and then I'll zoom in. Oh, I see in that back corner. As soon as I say that, huh? As soon as I said it, on the move. So that'll make its way down. Just some little bubbles in the back. So we'll, I'm kind of just watching to see if it's gonna come around. Ooh, not this camera. There we go. Please cue the gas bubbling. weather report this morning. Kilauea weather for us is probably, <laughs> <laughs> it was uh, it was colder than normal this morning, mm -hmm. probably upper 50s, mm -hmm. right? But the breeze was very light. Winter's coming, just a little trickle of wind, yeah. nothing to really write home about. Yeah, it was pretty chilly this morning. I already slapped on my gloves before I even got out of the truck. Ed checked in, good morning. Hey, good morning, Ed. Back and forth so I can mm -hmm. see as I come. <laughs> there we go. Made its way around. Oh, it's voggy down there, but that wind is blowing at our back, so we're not really too worried about it. Last week, when we when we went home on Sunday, with no air really moving for a while, we were pretty itchy all day. We think uh, we had some exposure. <laughs> Good morning, Sue. You guys, I already got a lot of food going. It's too early for me right <laughs> now.
Something got me. I guess for some, um, they get reading issues if uh, they have a sensitivity to air quality. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, that's mostly it's itching. Mm -hmm. My eyes get really red and itchy. And eyes and skin, not yeah, so much feels, throat. Yeah, feels for us, it feels like there's things crawling mm -hmm. on your face and eyes. and <laughs> You're being infested. <clears throat> 43, huh? Let's move it. We can hit that 100 this morning. Left bottom left is going. But yeah, I'm again. right on it right now. See, all we need to do is hit the valve, open up the air bubbles. Wow. Yeah, I'm talking about VOG. wasn't bugs. It's the VOG. Most times uh, when we go home, we're a little itchy. Normally not, but usually when we sit up here for four or five hours, going to have to. Go down, go home and scrub down. <laughs> Hose off. Hose off. <laughs> Take a gas detector with us. Well, you know, our gas detector really is watching that bog. We can see <laughs> it pretty good, and if we see it moving in our direction, it's a quick unhook and run. No, you know what, Jen? We never really thought about it either because we've never spent our life, you know, being uh, pounded with VOG. <clears throat> so, but that's about the only thing we can really come up with is that's what it is. It's either that or fleas. <laughs> <laughs> Gonna have to start using the flea and tick stuff that you give the dogs. Well, what's happening around the world? I see uh, some places are already starting to talk about fall. <laughs> right? No. And that means winter's coming for y'all. Nobody is, a, anybody that's complained about the heat this summer has lost their privilege of complaining about the cold during the winter. <laughs> I don't want to hear it. You got to pick one. You can't you can't have have it both ways. <clears throat> Lava lice. <laughs> yeah. Well that Pele's hair is no joke. That's dangerous stuff. You don't want to be breathing that. We saw a lot of that with the uh, 2018 eruption. Bugs are starting to hibernate. Yep, it's coming. Winters are coming for you, y'all. Us too. Time to break out the Mount Everest parkas. Temperatures dipped after Hurricane K, so it's been lovely this week. Back up to mid-90s next week. Hurricane K. I didn't even know there was a hurricane that was out there. Did you? 
Mm. I don't remember seeing yeah, we, anything. Yeah, I looked at it, but then it was, I don't, I think it was still small when we were uh. looking at it. Okay, Aurelio, H2O plus SO2 equals H2SO4. Okay. That's it. Now I'm dizzy. That's a little much too early. Yeah, winter board shorts. Yeah, made out of fleece. My teeth would chatter if I was wearing shorts up here. I don't remember where I put my coffee. Oh, no lights, remember? <laughs> no, no light, no light. Stop, turn it off. My camera there. Oh, I didn't know it was over there. <sighs> It'll be all right. That's like three times already this past day. You can edit it. I'll edit that out, don't you worry. <laughs> Good morning, Dennis. A couple of y'all watching while you're at work. Ooh. You in trouble, <laughs> sneaky. The park closed the Jagger lot? No, as far as I know, they didn't. Sue, take care. Thanks for coming in. A 109 mile an hour winds from that, huh? It grazed us, but definitely changed our weather pattern. It fell apart after us, I believe. Highest wind gust ever recorded in my in my county, 109 miles an hour. Poof, that's blasting. All right, we'll switch screens over there while we're waiting again for another push, which I see up at the top already. Now, if you look from where we're at, mm -hmm. the wind is so calm. If we were standing on the other side... Yeah, it's blowing right towards yeah, there, the isn't fog, it? Mm -hmm. The gas is blowing directly to our other viewing area. Yeah, so the, if, with the screen that's on there now, <clears throat> you can see the fog moving from right to left on the screen, and that looks like it's pushing directly to the other ledge to view. Interesting. I mean, it's just a trickle of wind. Thank you for getting your thumbs up in there. So it's 4.30 in the morning. <laughs> you say it with such enthusiasm. <clears throat> yes, it's 4.30 in the morning. And we are live at the Kilauea eruption. Yes, it is erupting <clears throat> on the Big Island of Hawaii in Hawaii Volcanoes National Park. Oh, everybody's still sleeping down there. Bahala doesn't move very fast. Well, none of us move very fast around here. I brought the umbrella, but the rain clouds are still coming. <laughs> we finally got a couple days of good rain. Not heavy, but good enough to put some water in the catchment. Mm -hmm. 
I mentioned that. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, hey, <laughs> we need a little rain. <laughs> yes, I am sure it's erupting. But let me look again. Yep, we're good. Big weekend for us, isn't it? <clears throat> you know, Your stomach, you mean? Not my stomach. Well, it's because everybody <laughs> was talking about cake and pies. <laughs> <laughs> Those are my favorite. <laughs> We're so grateful for your work to bring this all to these hours. You're so welcome. We're happy to get up here. <laughs> cake. <laughs> Does Hawaii observe daylight savings? Dennis says, nope, they do not. They, we do not recognize daylight savings. That's another weird but one. you guys should be able to pick up the sound of your stomach. I know. Because you're standing right in front of the let's microphone. Let's just let them know, that, let's just let them think that's the, the volcano, no, not my you stomach. Ask them, everybody be quiet for a second and listen into the stomach growling. <laughs> It's very loud. If I can hear it over there, mm -hmm. then oh, the uh, mic will pick it, that up. Oh, that bottom part is just... That front, I don't know if you want to call it bottom or front vent. Oh, I see it, yeah. Yeah. This morning it was really... I mean, when we first got here, it was really something... Mm-hmm. There we go. So you want to pick up a little bit here. Isn't daylight savings a growing season thing? It doesn't really apply in a climate like Hawaii's. I know, you know, Arizona doesn't recognize daylight savings. A couple states don't in the U.S. Um, pretty sure daylight savings was created during World War II. And we have a full greenhouse of plants, but I don't think they're smart enough to know about time. They kind of, you know, like us, we got to use the alarm to get up. They just kind of know when the sun's up, they get up. We have been noticing the sun going down earlier. Oh, yeah, that is nice. <laughs> the sun going down around, what What was it, mm. seven? Yeah. It was dark? So, oh, it's to so be nice. honest... We already sleep early. Everybody knows about yeah. eight eight thirty we start checking out. We're done. And now it's like, oh, it's getting dark earlier. <laughs> Good morning, Tony Miller on Maui. We've always been Hawaii standard time in Hawaii. Yep. Oh, wait a second. You know, it could have been for the farmers, too, huh? I don't know. Somebody's got to do some homework on that one. I'm curious now. I'm getting old, you know. I can't remember everything anymore. There's no such thing as getting old. <laughs> it's wise. Wiser, not old. Ah.
I think kids should walk to the bus stop when it's dark. It builds character. <laughs> I have no idea what that means when the earth is shaken with its final earthquake. That's all weird. Too early for me on that one. Oh, ooh. Is it my glasses or is it this camera? See the Vogue just playing games. The Vogue is thick. There we go. All right, let's see what this says here. <clears throat> Ms. L, post this up for us. <clears throat> Excuse me. DST, Daylight Savings Time, was first implemented in the U.S. with the Standard a Time Act of 1918, a wartime measure for seven months during World War I in the interest of adding more daylight hours to conserve energy resources. Well, what's really interesting about that was a measure for seven months. And uh, that's very popular, especially with our government. They say it's only going to be two weeks, and it turns into two years. Everything that I've all learned over my life, they say is temporary. Seems to always end up being permanent. No. Oh, good morning, Laura. Good morning, Laura. Jamie, what's going on over there? Uh, however, another source says daylight savings time is used to save energy and make better use of daylight. It was first used in 1908 in Thunder Bay, Canada. Now, speaking of Canada, I have to say, some of you have heard me mention this before, I get hooked on the the the, the border patrol show, <laughs> yeah. right? And I'm watching the entry points going into uh, Toronto, Vancouver. It is no joke. You guys are. I I thought I thought things were different up there, but getting in, whoo! Those those boys and girls at the the border patrol, they're no joke. They're checking everything. You, Why do you have all this money? Yeah. Why are you taking this? How much money you have? Let me open your computer. Open your phone. Let me take a look. You got any problems in the other other countries? Get out of here. I'm have walking you, you back. <laughs> <laughs> Don't lie to me now. Yeah, I was they, just that's blown what they away. Say. Don't, lie to me. <laughs> Don't you lie to me? It misrepresents us. I believe it. Yeah, I, I was never under the impression that it was that incredibly strict. Well, it's like that with the U.S. too. I guess, they, but... I mean, it, all, all border patrol, we watch Australia's border patrol, every country. Yeah, you're right. Like the same thing. Yeah, we, we yes. move through different <laughs> countries and never ask get asked, how much is in our bank account? Yeah. You know? <laughs> Let me open your phone so I can go through it. Open they your computer. That. It's just yeah, a that's show. what you're saying, yeah. They just, they just do that. Well, they got me hooked. <laughs> now I'm going to need a, a 10 step program to and get we, off of we've it. We've been watching it because, you know, we have Canada in the books for, yeah. <laughs> for traveling in the future. Yeah, I don't know if they're going to let you in. <laughs> no. Your, your, extensive in or your extensive record, they might not let you in. Okay, thank you. <laughs> they're going to go get all my food and snacks. That's what they're going to do. Yeah. All right, Shell. We don't need all the uh, 
the racket this morning on that. I really was like, well. <laughs> they watch American Border Patrol shows. <laughs> Well, we've had some run-ins with the border patrol, border crossings, I mean, all over the world. Never really anything crazy till somebody decided to pack her uh, pocket knives, her kitchen knives, her chopsticks. <laughs> they took, I was so angry. Well, they I think I mentioned it in the chat, too, when yeah. we were abroad. Like, they took all my utensils. <laughs> they took my chopsticks. They took your fork, took your spoon. They robbed me. They robbed you. They took your fishing. Well, we had two small fishing poles. They took that. Well, we yeah. Allowed to bring this across the border. Yeah, I've had those poles for twenty years. Never had a problem carrying them onto a plane. Upset. I was and, mad about those. Uh, the stupid thing you kept reminding me. I don't, you asked me why did you bring all the knives? Yeah. All of my knives. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, my real knives, not the uh, kitchen knives. I have all the things that anybody could forget. A bag full of knives going onto an airplane. Oh my gosh. Last chance, Aurelio. <laughs> yeah, she, yeah, Jen, chopsticks. <laughs> yep. yep. She had chopsticks, which we carry chopsticks so we could eat. <laughs> I, I, I always like to carry a pair of chopsticks. We're, we're really, we don't eat out much, but while that four months, we have to eat out a lot. But uh, next time you go to a restaurant, look around. Think about all the people that have used that fork that you're using right there. <laughs> they took all my stuff. They took everything. There was something else, though. All the, all the cutlery, the knives. Another trip through, they took the fishing rods. Yeah. What else did they take? Oh, the one thing we could bring was bottles of water. That was completely opposite. Yeah. <laughs> Security at Kona Airport tried to confiscate my kimchi. <laughs> <laughs> that's, no. That's because it was about lunchtime. <laughs> Hawaii Airport, as Honolulu got me years ago. Flying out of here, I had a jar of peanut butter with only about a quarter of it in it. They took oh, he that. was mad. Oh, I was mad. <laughs> like, but I need this. <laughs> That's my food. No joke down there, dude. I know. Our oldest spent uh, whew, almost a year on the river mm -hmm. in the Coast Guard and uh, working it. No joke. Had my bead crimper? Yeah. <laughs> <don't> wow. <laughs> That's right. You might pinch one of the flight attendants. <laughs> Can't have that. No, they left. They get, <laughs> I, that's I had dry. I actually was bread because I was making sandwiches. <laughs> I, they let me have my bread. The funny thing about south america with the alcohol was that even if you put vodka into the water bottle they didn't care they wouldn't care <laughs> walk around drink beer anyway you walk through the airport just walking through drinking a beer grocery store they don't matter i missed that ice technically ice is not water so what I tried to explain to them one day at the airport too, they didn't buy it.
Aurelio wants a full video on Mauna Loa trip. It's coming, it's coming. No, you keep saying It's coming, that. it's coming. Hawaii Pod last night, I think, was hinting at me. We finally, finally, this week, I've actually sat at my desk to be able to do some things. And uh, on covered the main computer. Dust. Yeah, covered in dust. Sheetrock dust. Would somebody like to take care of that? Aurelio, Don. Do you want to take that phone call? No. <laughs> if you put it on speaker, everybody no. will hear. They'll be like, what? <laughs> he's probably watching. Uh, he might be, huh? Yeah, that's probably Hold on. why he's calling. Go ahead. Hey. <laughs> His best friend, childhood best friend from California is calling. I just figured, I figured we were done. Just had a good run. Do you know what time it is? Yeah, there. Sleepy time, bot. <laughs> <laughs> I thought that many times, but no, not at all. It was beautiful. It was fun. It was tough, but that's all part of it. <laughs> he just hasn't really sat down on the computer to, to go over everything, and then we've been taking everything apart at our house, so, you know, putting things back together and cleaning it up every day after all that work, it's just, whew. Oh, you're back. Yeah. I didn't even see you, you creeper. <laughs> <laughs> you have your phone? Yeah. Can I borrow it? No. Thank you. <laughs> you took it anyway. Mm -hmm. Oh, let me get out of there. Oh, here. I'll let you do it. Shoot a night shot of that for me. Send a talk. Okay. Wait, um... Can you take my glove off of there? Mm -hmm. Just pull it off. I got to and hold that one. Okay. <laughs> because it's blurry. I got to push the thing. Is he watching? He was driving to work. Oh. You're going to have to call him back. Yeah. Let me take a high one. Okay. You want me to send it to him now? Is that the night shot? Yeah. Oh, no. Okay. You hold this for me, please. And this? Or do you want me to hold anything else? No, you wanted me to take a picture, and I'm going to take you a nice one. Let's see what you got. You try another one? That screen is really bright. Yeah. Let's try this. I'll turn the lighting all the way low. Okay. Better check the kids. Yeah, that'll work. <laughs> okay, I'll Ship send it that to off them now. To Here, let me have all my gadgets all right, there. Your gloves, your coffee, your bagel. <laughs> I don't have the bagel. <laughs> I would like a net bagel. All right. It's a mess, huh, Jen? You get behind on on pictures and video. It's game over. What we keep waiting for is that six weeks of rain. When we get the six weeks of rain and this house is buttoned up, that's where I'll be perched. But that's not something we look forward to, though. <laughs> no. Rain is no, cold. it's uh, that's brutal. Yeah. Cold. Oh, I see a, a little flare. Oh, it's probably not on your end, but I can see it on. There's a little flare up all the way to the left. 
Oh, I see it. Laura's saying, I was telling Mrs. P that we were disciplined when we used to film. Now that our photo taking is digital, total chaos. Yep. Digital makes it nuts. I mean, I, the one thing is everything is in folders on multiple <laughs> drives. <laughs> Dude, is this the one year tilt chart for the kill way of trying to tell us something? This will be interesting. Yeah, this is interesting. Uh, we just kind of, uh, settle down but we've been watching over the last couple weeks that we have we've seen the ups and the downs i mean we could stop streaming this morning by the time we get home something could open up and we're right back to where we were yeah dennis six weeks of rain no. sometimes more and that's kind of the pattern at our house we go six weeks of rain six weeks of sun Six on, but we six off. We haven't seen that in a little while. Six weeks. We've been pretty much at six weeks since we've had the downpours. We can usually tell how many weeks it is by the level of our water tank, which is, are we at half yet? No, not so yet. So we're still <laughs> under half, which means we're probably five weeks since the last big pounder. I got it. Ed gave my phone. It's probably his thing. See, I see the message. Actually, Ben Franklin proposed to EST back in 1784, according to Wikipedia. Mm, ben Franklin. Keeps firing just a little bit. It wants to kick up. I see a beam shining down from the Jagger Museum.
Don't worry, Aurelio. If I find out they got a room up there, I'm booking it for you. <laughs> Look how pretty the moon is up here. It's hurting my back looking. Oh, it's straight over us, huh? Yeah. Those clouds will... Yeah, they look wet. <laughs> I don't remember the last time we were up here on a Friday, do you? Mm-mm. I think that's Todd. Mm-hmm. Oh, Hermione, Anna is the master of exploding jars and... Uh, dropping Dropping things. jars. <laughs> Breaking things. Oh, oh. wonderful. <laughs> oh, another jar bites the dust. Yeah. Just on the boat so we can oh, see yeah. the kind of like the glow on the bottom. Mm -hmm. He says pretty cool. He was on the way to work. Yeah. Said? Oh, it reminds me, met Laura mentioning that in the scheme of the book cleanup, you know, like when people drop things, things explode, blah, blah, blah. Remember that time I wasn't paying attention, I was making fish stew? Oh, yeah. You used the wrong pot on the... On yeah, the, on the stove. On yeah, the on the gas burner. It, it exploded. <laughs> yeah. We were. Yeah, there's <laughs> some, some things you can't put on... Open yeah, fire. I know. I wasn't mm -hmm. paying attention. I was probably mm -hmm. in La La Land. It was late, too. <laughs> Lost the fish, too. It was yep. really good white fish. What, what, what was that? I think it was Mahi Mahi. No. Or Ono. One of the two. I can't actually remember. It was white fish. But yeah, that was stinky. I was more upset that that was the last bit of the fish. With the stew that I really wanted to eat. Oh, we've all been there, haven't we? Pouring grease into something. Look what I found. Ooh. Yeah. Gurgle. Mm-hmm. <laughs>
think, Dennis, that was the the uh, Pyrex. I think that's what you put on the front. <laughs> I think that's what that, that was. It was blue. Yeah, I think that's what it was, that Pyrex that she put on the gas stove. I wasn't paying attention. And kaboom. Fishy stew is pretty hard <laughs> when it gets everywhere to clean it. <laughs> Just smells like feces. We'll keep an eye on that. We'll switch back over here. Oh, yeah, another one moving. Gas eater. Mm hmm. Yeah, Laura, I agree, which she has, but for some reason, I don't think she's ever cooked in that Pyrex pot before, yeah. but <laughs> I don't, I don't know, know what she was thinking. Maybe she thought, ooh, pretty, I can see through it. <laughs> I, I don't know. I don't ever, I, don't, I just sit back and watch the show. She's like, what are you doing? <laughs> I don't know. Hermione was just talking about the first time she cooked for her boyfriend, now husband, and blew up a can in the, in the kitchen. <laughs> Yeah, you've had a lot. I, I just had this tendency to break things all the time. Mm-hmm. Probably went down onto the trail. It creeps me out. It's kind of weird, isn't it? Did I hear anything? No, I heard it. Mm -hmm. But they probably dropped down onto that trail. Sixty-seven, right on. We're getting closer. If you just join us, thank you for being here with us. We are Lou and Anna, two pineapples, live at Kilauea on the Big Island, Hawaii, at, at Hawaii Volcanoes National Park, above the Kilauea eruption, which is erupting slowly right now. So hit that thumbs up. Subscribe, share us out. Good morning, Lane. There is our latest update which we are 20 feet higher than we were a month ago. 143 meters, 469 feet.
111 million cubic meters, 29.2 billion gallons of lava. Since the beginning of its eruption, which started almost a year ago, September 29th, 2021. Good day for getting things done. Well, that'll be us, but I was already warned this morning as on the walk-in that somebody standing next to me was gonna take a nap when we got home. My hip hurts. Oh, that's a good reason to take a nap. <laughs> it's like just been really bothering me. So, <laughs> but I say that. Mm -hmm. She oh, says that, but she- I don't ever take a nap. Next thing you know, she disappears and she's in the greenhouse or <laughs> somewhere. Try not to because it disrupts my sleep mm -hmm. at night. Lizoid says, I can see measure in milk and gallons, but not lava. Well, we do actually have a measurement in something other than English. A lot of traffic this morning, huh? Really? Well, it's Friday. It's payday for everybody. Got to go to work to get your check on a Friday. Okay. Tuesday, Wednesday, maybe not going to go in. <laughs> but going in on a Friday. Yeah, it's cool breeze, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Find it hard to nap during the day, even when I know I need it. Uh, not me, Laura. <laughs> <laughs> not me. We go home from this uh, these live streams in the morning. I have no problem putting my feet up on the couch and uh, drifting away. You know, it's funny, Dennis, that we always use maybe an Olympic swimming pool or a football field to measure things. And uh, I don't remember who it was. It said the, 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 the caldera, which is three miles by two miles wide and, and long, was equivalent to how many football fields? I don't know. Yeah, Don, you might have missed a day. Yep.
Yeah, really, but your your siesta is what uh four o'clock after dinner. Where's that supper? Spanish eat like hobbits. Like five, six meals a day. <laughs> I did it again. Spilling the coffee? Yeah, oh my goodness. Did you put sugar in that? Like a tablespoon, I mean a teaspoon. You try it? Yeah. Always spill coffee on myself. What's over there? I'm trying to clean up my coffee mess. Oh my goodness. The last time I missed. Not too bad, eh? Mm mm. I just put like a teaspoon in there. Take me to a public restaurant. Oh, I can't take you anywhere. Mm -hmm. I oh, I think I missed. No, that's not it. <laughs> Those two gas bubbles right there, three gas bubbles kind of merge. We might see some nice little activity pick up. Are you watching this right corner here, or the mm -hmm. right front? That's the one that keeps waking up and going mm -hmm. back to sleep. I'm hoping this will push around and make its way over there, mm -hmm. which it should. Oh, I didn't tell you guys the good news. I have my MRI tomorrow. On a Saturday, if you can believe it, of all times to have an MRI. <laughs> you were saying too, like, huh? Yeah, so into the magical $3 million tunnel. I like Doc. I like your uh, your live streamy run because I I jump over there and take a look to see if there's snow on the ground constantly now. That's my cue. That's when I know winter's uh, hitting you guys. Oh, there we go. I'm gonna have to move this camera. That's what I've been waiting for. Mm -hmm. Oh, but nothing. Nothing coming out yet. Good morning, Henry. Well, they're going to. <laughs> wear the paper gown. <laughs> that was, that was it. You know, what do you wear to an MRI? Well, they make you change into that gown. That paper well, gown? That opens the <laughs> is the back open or does the front open? <laughs> the back. Okay. It goes this way. And then the whole back opens. Will they let me keep it? Because when I did mine last year, <laughs> I was freezing. They gave me a blanket. <laughs> <laughs> Are they going to let me keep it? Bring it home? No, they're not going to let you keep it. No? No. Nothing's free in this world. Oh yeah, you know the four letter word I'm talking about. It's a coming.
Tattoos and MRIs are not friends. Well, that's interesting. Huh. I did get asked a million questions. I didn't get asked that question. pigments hmm. well, as far as I know I don't have any magnets in me that I know of or metal screws no screws I got some loose yeah. screws <laughs> <laughs> you got more than just some. I guess that's one way to look at it. Huh? I, I am kind of going into a giant microwave, huh? <laughs> that's weird now that I think about it. No, I get it. The iron and the tattoos. Well, I've got a couple, so we'll see. And they're old, so. Mm -hmm. But they're only doing my my leg. They're not scanning anywhere else. Hmm. Magnetic resonance imaging. Well, it's my first one. <laughs> I think I've had two, two MRIs. You've had two? Maybe three. It was when I had, when I got into my car accident, they did one on mm -hmm. me to check my spine and um, then my disc bulge went wrong. Mm -hmm. I remember. Oh, with the tumor, right? That bubble's just sitting there. It is not moving. The volcano. No, it wasn't.
still have 2.5 50 more minutes to go. Here's a little one. Really, I thought you were having sardines. <laughs> Sun. I don't feel normal without my uh, liter of coffee. Mm -hmm. Just spill any on yourself? No. <laughs> Dennis is asking, can you feel the heat of the lava from your viewing position? Nope. We are two miles back. Top screen, take a look at the top screen. I'm going to pan back. That's how far back we are. We'll get a better idea once that sun comes up. Oop, too fast. bread we finally got some bread yesterday didn't we mrs. P's uh, easy bake oven she hasn't had any bread in there in forever I've been making bread when was the last time you made bread <laughs> uh, we don't necessarily have a functional kitchen right not now. right now <laughs> no <laughs> oh it's functioning Yeah, right, Dennis? It's pretty, we're pretty far back. Thought y'all were a lot closer than that. You have really good cameras. Well, we have great equipment because of all of our members, Super Chatters, all of our supporters. Thank you, everybody. You've brought uh, some great equipment for all of us to enjoy. If you're not subscribed to the channel, that is free. You can hit that big red button. Bread sitting at like 10 bucks a loaf here. And diesel still 6.55 a gallon. They do just do not want to budge on the diesel. Some water. Yeah, prices are nuts over here. That's why our greenhouse is so important. And that once every three month run to Costco.
Yep, and we get that. What did we did we just get a twenty five pound bag of flour last time we were at Costco? Twenty five pounds. Yeah, we did, huh? Yeah. We usually we usually make our own bread and tortilla and miscellaneous stuff, but not lately. Two cents a loaf. Doc, how old are you? That's rude. <laughs> That's he not says polite. back in back in nineteen seventy. Diesel so yesterday. Oh no. Ain't taking my truck away from me. I'll be the last one driving it. Although if it's any constellation, my truck does have a plug in the front of it. I don't think it'll charge the truck, but it'll sure heat up the oil good. See the sun coming up on this other camera yet? Aloha. <laughs> yes, I do have a block heater for my diesel truck in Hawaii. Absolutely. <laughs> well, the truck always didn't always live in Hawaii. We were in other places, which it did come in handy up uh, eight, nine thousand feet up in Arizona on the Mogollon Rim or Colorado, Montana be able to plug that thing into the generator the one time <laughs> we went camping i didn't put the generator I, we brought the trailer but i just figured it was a quick two night trip the batteries in the trailer were good enough for the heater didn't even think about it and uh when you know it it snowed while we were up there it was like october up on the muggy on rim in arizona and uh the truck wouldn't start <laughs> I had to build a big fire, throw in a bunch of big rocks, and heat them up, put them under the truck. <laughs> kind of, yeah, Laura. I mean, it, the, the, the Super Duty we drive is it's designed for cold weather. That's the only way. It, it drops below 30 degrees. She don't like starting. Yeah, Wisconsin, anywhere up north. Did you hear that? You had an earthquake or was that your stomach? <laughs> that was my stomach. You had your truck on a boat. Yes, my truck has been on a boat a few times.
Oh, you can start to see the caldera light up a little bit now, huh? Mm -hmm. I've been staring at screens. I haven't looked down. Sun is coming. Freight for my truck was at fifteen hundred bucks, mm -hmm. somewhere right around there. A little kerosene in that diesel will help thin her out a little bit. But I prefer just to plug it in before I end up exploding it. When I threw them rocks under the truck, I was a little worried that there might have been a little leak somewhere. And we were 35 miles deep like, into the mountains. Back. Yeah, stand back. <laughs> we were 35 miles deep in October with uh, just a few random hunters out there. There was nobody up in the mountains. He just might, Don, he just might. Well, both our vehicles, it costs us just as much to ship vehicles than it does to ship your dog. The dogs were actually more. <laughs> the dogs are like 2,500 bucks. Mm -hmm. Five K from Washington to Washington State seems because I know that a lot of we know quite a few people from here that go six and six or six months here and six months in Alaska, and uh, it's right around that fifteen to eighteen hundred dollars to ship a truck to Alaska. <laughs> Is coconut flour cheaper than regular bleached flour? <laughs> I don't know. No. I don't think so. It's more expensive. A word that's not commonly used here is cheap. <laughs> oh my. I would say the next uh, most uncommon word here used is available. <laughs> <laughs> or fast. Or fast, yes. <laughs> Things we do not have here on the island. Cheap. Fast and available. <laughs> <laughs> well, they got flour from everything. Hey, that's one thing you can milk is a coconut. Oh, my goodness. Mm hmm. You keep talking about milking weird things. Because we were watching Meet the Fockers. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Milking the cat. Uh, the you cat. can well, you can you can milk anything. <laughs> you want to milk a cat? You want to yeah. milk a bird? Milk a bird. You want to milk a coconut? Mm -hmm.
Light's changing fast. Mm -hmm. Well, one thing about this side that's kind of bummer is I can't see the I'll take oh, the a sunrise, of the sunrise, yeah. Back there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, milk and a coconut's easy. Mm hmm. Yeah, it has its own storage containers. And dude's right. Mm. Lava flower. Hmm. <laughs> what the heck's going on? Mrs. Owen just must be listening while she's still at work. <laughs> We never know where where this show's going to go. We never know. Yeah, exactly, Ed. Ed says, available is used a lot in Hawaii. As an example, he put a sentence up there, as in not available. Yep. Yeah, on the commercials, if you ever look at the very bottom in fine print, it always says, not available for shipping to Alaska mm -hmm. and Hawaii. Yeah. Ugh. Only the, the 48 contingent states. Yep. And that happens a lot. A lot. Coconut flour is nice mixed in cake mix. Mm -hmm. zoomed in so hard that you can see the gas is moving around. Pull that back a bit. Later Lane, have a good day. Thanks for joining us. You would think it would be uh, cheaper here, but it's not. the glow on the right side yeah that's the west vent that's back there this one here was left of that vent. 
we don't see much activity from too often anymore. You're getting, what'd you say, you're getting sneezy? I'm watching it, yeah. There you go. Good morning, Sid, for brains. Robert, good morning. All the gas down there is making focusing tough. Quirky gave us super chat. Says oh. coffee for you in appreciation. <laughs> Mahalo. Hey, thanks, Chris. Thank you, Chris.
Good morning. Hermione's taken off. Have a good day. And they call. Thanks for joining us. Sun's coming up. Mm -hmm. I can see the sun. Aloha, LA color. Good morning. Yep, go ahead. You can defer all, all phone calls uh, from the boss right to me. I'll take care of it. <laughs> Dennis, he's not getting any work done. What are you talking about? Morning.
Right now, temperature at uh, 56 is probably 57 degrees. I missed uh, <clears throat> everybody breaking the hammers out. Yeah. <laughs> Another one of the spam bots. Yeah, this is the time in the morning. We'll really see how much gas is coming. You can see that. Let me drop it so much. So I'm going to jump over here. Get a full shot of the caldera. A bit cold. Yeah, it's definitely cold, huh? Mm -hmm. But they can't, like, the floor crusted and dark. Yeah. The floor is, like, unusually oh. dark this morning, isn't it? Spooky.
was a heck of a road trip you took, Ed. What's, what was it? They said 4,000 miles or something? Almost 5. Almost 5,000 <laughs> miles. definitely feel different without a, a tankard of coffee in me. Slower? Yeah, <laughs> slower. My eyes are less, less focusy. Four thousand four hundred seventy-five miles. Jeez, that's a haul. Say hi to the crew. That that has been considered a coffee IV. Okay. Very good. Let me take off my snow cap. Just kidding. Are you picking your nose? <laughs> no, I'm not. All right. Just making sure because I, you know, you get reminded. Uh -huh. I'm picking my nose. Hey, here Aloha. we are. Good morning. <laughs> We are not shutting off the stream. We just wanted to say hi. Good morning. It's Aloha <laughs> Go Friday. Longer, yeah. We're going to keep streaming, but uh, <laughs> we haven't been on camera this morning. So thank you all for joining us. We are live here at Kilauea, Hawaii Volcanoes National Park, one week away from the one-year anniversary of mm -hmm. this current eruption. It went by pretty fast. Yeah. Well, we were gone for... Well, I wasn't talking about that. <laughs> <laughs> we were gone for like four or five Counting months September. of it. September. That's true. That's true. It did go pretty fast. And hopefully she hangs on because the park has some uh, ceremonial activities planned. Mm -hmm. It would be kind of a bummer if uh, everything kind of fizzled out, wouldn't it? Mm -hmm. And you're looking over here. Yeah. <laughs> it's usually me telling myself <laughs> to look over there. Uh, hit that thumbs up. Share us out. Come on, you guys have Facebook accounts. If you haven't joined us on Facebook, you know, find us on Facebook, Discord. Uh, share us out wherever you can. Instagram. Instagram. Send a... Uh, Send a URL, our, a link to your buddy. Our Facebook's not really that active. We don't really no. do much. We just opened that yeah. a little while ago. And we don't stream there after, no. the, after yeah. I was... You had problems, too. Mm -hmm. Some stream key stuff. And mm -hmm. they... Uh, they blocked me. Blocked you for... Yeah, I went to... Singing. Yeah. yeah that's what it was. Yeah. <laughs> yep. What ceremonies? Mm -hmm. uh, the, the park... I'm not sure everything that they're doing. I think it was just maybe be a... A breakdown of yeah ceremonies. There's and two food. that I'm aware of. Yeah. Oh, there's food. I oh, heard, we're in. That's what I. <laughs> you don't know that for sure. <laughs> I just heard talk. Chandra. Yeah. And so. it's gonna be up uh, by the Jagger Museum, I think. One of them. One of them's there, and the other. You're one not is... even sure. I'm You're not. just making all these assumptions. <laughs> well, this is a, this is a good idea. <laughs> He's just guessing. <laughs> He's just guessing. Download the NPS app. You get all your information there. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Which I have downloaded. Misleading. It is. I did download that NPS app a while back. It is pretty good. It mm -hmm. breaks down the trails and the overlooks. And, uh, we got to talk to Phil a little bit more to find out more details. Yes. He just gave us like a little just bits a and pieces. Snip. I'm pretty sure he's listening too. Probably. <laughs> From so that's Hawaii it. Pod. So, all right. Thank you all. We're flipping uh -huh. back around. <laughs> I want to. Go what, are you, what are you? Go ahead, you can go. 
they, that way they can kind of see the sky. It's mm -hmm. pretty today. It's clear. Mauna Loa is coming up in sight here. That's too bad this tree is right, right here. But it's okay. It's not wobbling. What's NPS? NPS is National Park Service. If you can't find it in your app store or at the uh, Google Play Store, uh, I'll put a link up later on it. It's actually pretty good. So it just put us on uh, Facebook. Right off our food, we're there. <laughs> <laughs> Idaho, Montana, Wyoming, Colorado, New Mexico, Arizona, California, Oregon, back home. Isn't that a song? I can't sing. I don't want to get a copyright strike because no. my my voice is. Uh, you tend to have that oh, song. <laughs> I have the voice that the algorithm picks up on. Oh yeah, it don't matter where you're at. Anytime you sing, you get a copyright. Strike. Yeah, it's because it's so good. No. It's so chilly, you can see the condensation and moisture on the camera. On my camera, the mm -hmm. lens. <laughs> Even the backpack's a little moist. Wait for the big luau. Us too. We like a good luau. Are they? Wesley, aloha. Thanks for joining us. Splush. Splush. <laughs> you said splush. Yeah, because Dennis right. Dennis is the one that started All right. it. Well, I'm adding splush. Splushies. He said splushies. Well, there's splushies, but you said Dennis. splush. So I'm adding that to the book. We have a new word. New word of the day, splush. No, it's not the day. Dennis started that like last oh. week or so. Splushies. He says splushies. <laughs> what do we miss? Did you scroll back to the chat a little bit? Mm. I didn't see you. Oh, <laughs> it was quoting the song. I've been everywhere, yeah. man. I was gonna sing it, but nope. I said, I'll "Now go we're home. gonna get a copyright yeah. strike because yeah. I sang it." We'll go home and I'll see the red, the red yep. letters on our dashboard on the computer mm. saying, "You're busted again." Because of me. Yep. right there or is that steam I'm gonna give you ladies and gentlemen the captain has turned on the seatbelt sign <laughs> please uh, administer any drama mean if you have it. <laughs> Where is it? Where? 
Where am I looking? I don't know where straight I'm going. A, straight ahead, 12 o'clock. And to the left. There you go. Come on down. It might just be steam, but I think that's the B1 cam. Ooh. <laughs> where is this? This way? Am I there yet? Mm -mm. It's way out there. I mean, that's a good, like, good two and a half miles. Yeah, straight right there. Ah, okay. Oopsie. Is that it? No, I think that's just the wall and crusties. Keep going. What's that on the bottom left? Bottom left. What's that? This way? Let's take a look. Hang on, guys. It's me controlling the camera. No. I don't have such soft hands as... Oopsie. <laughs> I don't see it. There. I don't either. Yeah. It's over there. Somewhere. Somewhere. Um, let's take a look. Let me go cruising here. I think, haven't we seen it before? Do you guys see anything? That's not it. <laughs> I think that's too far back. That could be it right there. That could be the camera. I thought it was closer. This way? Let's see here. Hang on, guys. <laughs> I just cut her loose. <laughs> she's all she's all your responsibility now. Are you talking about this one right here? Yeah. I think that's too far back for the B1 camera. I could have swore I saw a clip of it being closer. Okay, guys. Rachel I'm says hi, pineapples. <laughs> I'm having a question. Go ahead, ask away. Whoopsie. Just know we are Whoopsie. not uh, we're not scientists, volcanologists, geologists. We are the point and shoot crew. With great pictures, and sometimes you get a little nauseous. <laughs> what? Yeah, um, Ed, I, I cut her loose. It makes me think of Subi. Mm -hmm. He's probably lurking. He, he wasn't feeling well last mm -hmm. week. So hopefully he's feeling a little better. If you're listening, Subi, Mike, we're thinking of you. Hoping you're feeling better. You think that those are the same instruments that you're talking about? No, I think I don't think so. I think the B1 camera's closer because well, I could have swore I saw a picture of it, like somewhere on a down now. on the lower yeah, side down there. See if I can look for it. Let's go, guys. Somewhere like here on this side. We'll be experiencing <laughs> mild turbulence. Please remain in your seat. It is kind of cool that the lighting is so nice today. That yeah, it is nice, the, huh? You can see the caldera nice and clear as it mm -hmm. falls on the other side. Whoopsie. Hmm. Maybe it's somewhere we can't like down this way. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Somewhere down like this way, right here. It's somewhere down there. Yeah. Is this one over right here is there? too. No, that's steam. No. No, that's just rock. No. Whoa! <laughs> that's what I was thinking too, Ed. More like a sensor. Yeah, I don't see anything. Ooh, you know what's cool? I don't know. Let's see. Over there, look. We didn't see that much steam on this side last week. I'm going as slow as I can, you guys, against this wall here. Oh, no, the trees are <laughs> Me <way>. too. <laughs> I yeah. love a little nausea with my volcano viewing. We're going to steam here. Where are you at? Over on this side. Uh -huh. no, right side, see? Yeah, I see that. What is that, a goat? No, it's not a goat. There's no goats here. There's a lot of Did gas Did Rachel ask on. a question and we missed it? A little more light. You might be able to get some shots of them hornitos down yeah. there. For well, now, I better give the kids a, a little break before they get too uh, nauseous. No, I'm sure everybody's cupboards are stocked with uh, Dramamine. <laughs> Zoom in on the road. Scott, hey, Scott, where are you at? 
You know, see, he's on the road somewhere. Hmm. Where is he at? On that road on that side? Yeah. Oh, this side maybe. Yeah. Huh. Zoom in on the road, straight Let's out to the left. Let's go. Where? I don't know. Let's see where he's at. Scott with the Pow Hawaii Tours. If you were watching uh, the last stream, had a little cameo. That, that I see people walking there. It's probably there? Scott no, over there. I don't think no. So. That's not it. Go full screen here so I can see a little better. I don't know where I'm looking. I have no clue. I'm confused. Where is it? Am I too far? No, no, there's the road. You're on it. Okay. I don't know what part. Hmm. See? Right there, is that a person there? No, that's the sign. I can see a sign there. <laughs> he says no. The road that fell into the crater. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> we thought you were on the road. Do you know where that's at? Or do you want me to zoom in? No, you can okay. look. I, I'm making everyone dizzy. <laughs> Ms. Al just posted something about the festival or the ceremony here. Let me take a look and scroll up. Whoopsie. Fog is just cutting the view on the road pretty hard. He's all left. left. <laughs> Hard to see with this fog. Yeah. Hmm. Whoa. there but it's just boggy across right now I think that's it that's it and Don did you catch that question I didn't uh, when the earth is shaking it is uh, oh one of those okay moving on <laughs> yep Dennis 100% We need to we need to build a forge at the house. So all these guys, all the hammers we need to to make as blacksmiths. It's getting a little crazy. These are so boggy. Thank you, Scott. And to see how much bog is out there right now. It's going straight up. D.B. Puckett just say more like children playing with video cameras? Is, is that us? We resemble that remark. What? <laughs> <laughs> yep.
how easy is it to escape from Jagger Museum? I don't know, Rilio. You're going to have to tell us when we uh, book you your room in there. Scott says, thanks for the live this morning. Hope everyone has a wonderful weekend. Aloha. Thanks, Scott. Actually surprised we didn't catch you up here. I know you like Friday mornings. Scott with the Powell Hawaii Tours. If you're booking a trip to the Big Island and you want to trip around the volcano, contact Scott. Are you watching for your nanas? You look at the footage on the GoPro. I see you birds that are up here this time. Where's the camera at? Where's the camera at? <laughs> You're so funny. <laughs> <laughs> no neighbors to escape. They escaped to the port. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> you want this one? What is? Yeah. Look at the birds. No, that, no, that's that might be problems. Better not. You can do it. Next time, I'll find some other way to. You want to get on, zoom in up on Jagger, for me. Camera three. You keep giving me numbers. Of which That's right. I haven't put the <laughs> I haven't put the different. sticker on there for you. Yeah. <laughs> because sometimes you have it on that side, and then the other side, and I get confused. Look, it's nice and sunny up there, but mm -hmm. it's warm over there now. You want to go closer? Mm-hmm. See if anybody's up in the tower. Anybody watching? Wave. They're probably watching that. Let me get a big. Hold on. Let me get a full, you're going full screen. Mm. Anybody in there? I don't see anybody in there. No. And it looks like there's somebody sitting on the uh, left side, see there? I see that. Hold her steady. Oh, I can't, hold on. <laughs> Hang on, let me try again. Do you see that left side? Yeah, let me go it's full kinda screen fuzzy, again. kind of fuzzy though, so far. It looks like there's somebody sitting up there. It does, but I don't... Oh, it sure does, doesn't yeah. it? Yeah. I don't know. All right, we better...
better stop stalking people. You're stalking people. <laughs> <laughs> Look on this side. See, it's not polite to stalk. You better stop. <laughs> Look it out a little bit. Just so everybody can get an idea of how it looks there. It says, there's a really old. <laughs> <laughs> That's probably who it was, Hud. He's talking Aurelio. He's in jail. It's Tower. Okay, I'm going to zoom out. Slowly. You see how far we really are from there. Good morning, Kathy. Bye, Aurelio. <laughs> Go back to lava. Uh, get that, some of these, this big, huge crack that comes all the way around there. See if you can zoom in on that. You say it like there's only one crack. Which right here, to the, to the right, down here. It's huge. <laughs> <laughs> this? We might only have a few more months to document uh, all this upper. Are you talking about this one right here? Yeah. The gas on the ledge in front of you, is that new? Uh, that's what we're just now, that's, yeah. that's, we're just now moving the camera to, dude, is because, uh, that's it just kind of popped up on us. It's so, uh. Usually we start seeing all the steam and everything come through about this time of the morning. Oops. Not just because the sun comes up, but something about the evaporative activity that's happening. And, but this is, so, I'll have to look at a past live. It looks new. Toasty down there. Mm -hmm. now where else am I going? Am I even going to the right spot you want? Yeah, just pan out just a fuzz to the left. There Here. you go, yeah. Uh -huh. Yeah. Here we go. See, I told you, get the fires in the forge going. Running out of hammers this morning. Yeah. <laughs>
There we go. Current temp, 58 degrees. Wind speed, 5 miles an hour. Look who dropped in. Hold on. Jay Gordon. What? <laughs> Jay. <laughs> What's happening, Jay? We have missed you. We know you've been busy. Lots mm -hmm. going on. Is this the Live Golf Tour page? Yes, it is. <laughs> we will move the camera now out to the uh, fourth fairway. Life is good. Hope family is doing well too, Jay. Oh, look, we got a little footballs here because I spilled coffee on myself and the, the wife. Look, it's all powdery now. So gross. Take all this off. Hope nobody's watching. <laughs> oh, we made it over a hundred. Nice. Thank you, Ed. Two hours thirty seven two hours thirty five minutes and thirty seconds. Not bad. Aurelio, busy with neighbors, make them bold. Good job, Aurelio. <laughs> Bust out the paella. Crazy boggy down there. Finally, my toes are warming up. Woo! That's going to feel nice on our back. Yeah, it's warming up. It is so, so gassy right now. Mm -hmm. Kilauea is a uh, relatively young volcano. The island itself is only about 800,000 years old. She's been erupting here for quite a while though.
and to see lava. Mm -mm. Too much fog down there. Yeah. That was just in, yeah. Trying a new feature. Which is? Watch this. Ah. And it should go. It did. Yep. Okay, like that. And we change to the next screen. Aha! And three. <laughs> you tried it last time. No, Remember? I've been trying the auto, that's the auto switch. Oh. Mm-hmm. Go for it. Like a thick. I'm gonna disable this. Go ahead. Thick. Um, that. No, that's not, Mizell. That's the. That's different than the anniversary ceremony that's happening next week. The volcano. Up here. Lava yeah, it's the one-year anniversary of this eruption that's happening. That festival that you put up there is the fall festival. Right here. Hold on, don't move that camera. Oh, man. <laughs> you, you were going to grab that one. Yeah. Look, look at this wall here. that you put it on. Yeah. Can you do a uh, slow mm -hmm. pan out and then go back in? Slow? Yeah. You're telling me to do Ladies a Ladies and gentlemen, the captain out. is turning on the uh, fasten okay, seat I'm belt. Gonna we're going to pan out and show you where that wall is at. Oh, not too bad. There you go. You're doing great. What? There you go. I'll get back in there. You want me to go back in now? Yeah, get back in. Oh, okay. Whoa! Oh, jeez. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> the pan out was nice, yeah. but the pan in went a little too <laughs> fast. Go a little bit here. That's pretty cool. is going that way. It's kind of staying right here, but mm -hmm. that way. <laughs> yep, there goes a little birdie again. They're like this big. Yeah, they're small, huh? Mm -hmm. That's why when they get close to the, the trees near us, I want to get them, but mm -hmm. they move so fast. 
Yeah, they've had a lot of coffee. Return to your seat. Pass them seat belts. <laughs> That's really billowing out of there, isn't it? Thank you so much. Oh, you just missed it. Hmm? You did. That little finch just came right down here. Some of these other ones, they're not finches because I see a little red. Look, those? he's in the grass. All right, go get him. Oh. They got off that one. Let me get him. I don't know. Undo the power. Huh? Power. Which, this no, one no, no, no. There, this one. there you go. It's kind of hard to see if mm -hmm. I don't know where they're at. Let me take a look here. He moved so fast. He was on that grass right there. They're gonna go. Mm hmm. You just have to wait. Well, that wall just picked up more momentum. I hear you. Mm -hmm. I thought he was gonna land on that tree right there. Put this back on until you spot your bird. Mm. Hear the kitchen over at Volcano House. Oh, I got something for you. See this bottom east wall mm -hmm. right right there can you zoom in down there where the crusty is yeah go for it the powdery um yeah look i'm gonna go like over here it's not right on this edge wall that one here mm -mm. straight out this way are you looking at my camera mm-hmm mm-hmm here to the right and down there you go right there We're finally dropping frames, two hours and 45 minutes in. Mm -hmm. Isn't that funny? <laughs> nope, Volcano House has been open for quite a while now. And I think I hear them banging on pots and pans.
this time of morning, every, everybody's waking up and getting on their phones. Service is dropping. Mm -hmm. and Seventy percent drop frames. Don't make me <laughs> Google again. <laughs> mm -hmm. Alright guys, that's the show. <laughs> it's funny, we're two hours and 45 minutes in and it happened twice before now we noticed about this time, I guess when more people start getting up, he spotted a bird. Lost her. Oh. No. Nope. No, it's it's a bigger size, but it's beautiful. Oh. It's huge. It's right here. Let's take a look. No, you can't get there. <laughs> no, no, continue talking to me. Just ignore me. <laughs> oh, butterfly! La la la! Ignore me. <laughs> Sorry. Are you done? <laughs> <laughs> it was that big. It's oh, a bigger yeah. one She's than the original. She's been dying. Dying. Yeah, I'm gonna. You know what we'll do is I'll set up just a bird cam for you. That's yeah. what you need. Well, we have one extra camera that we didn't bring. Yeah, That's we, why I wanted we, to bring it, too. I yeah, wanted to I pulled it out. We'll bring you the bird yeah. cam. How's that? Um, I you? haven't been able to catch the birds when I, you know, with these cameras. So we right. show everybody, too. I've been dying to catch them. But it's okay. All right. Next stream, bird cam it is. <laughs> Anyways. <laughs> <laughs> Off topic. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Thanks, everybody, for joining us. Uh, we probably most likely will be back up on uh, Sunday morning for our normal show. That's... No, 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 no. Remember, you have your MRI Saturday, depending on how things go, and da, da, da. that's why we kind of went into the How things go? What's going to happen at Not, the MRI? Okay. Now I'm paranoid. Uh, you, you <laughs> should I quote what you said? You forget. I forgot. Okay, good. Don't bring it up. Yeah. <laughs> that's why we did the stream today. Maybe we'll do a Sunday show. Oh we don't my know. Goodness. We'll be back when we get back. <laughs> Thanks, everybody, for hanging out with us. Hit the thumbs up. Share us out. Drop a comment if you're watching this on a replay. Mm -hmm. Uh, which the subscription button's the big red one we just dropped. The subscription button's the big red one. We're dropping frames like crazy. I gotta be quick. Hit the big red button. It's yes. free. Thanks again, everybody. We're Appreciate gonna cut this before all. it drops Aloha. off. Aloha. Jay, good to <laughs> see you. We missed you. Been forever. <laughs> Sorry if we missed things here and there. <laughs> Funny about the drop frames this mm -hmm. time of the morning, huh? 111. Nice work, guys. Thank you, all the mods. It's quite a busy morning with hammers. We'll get the forge <laughs> fired up. I'll cut, cut some more firewood. Mm -hmm. Let's see if I can see anything. Duck yet. Fox, appreciate it. Can you can switch the hammer so they can see mm -hmm. other views. Yeah. There you go. Thank you. Morning. Good morning. You still got little glowy eyes here on that bottom bent here. Everybody agrees that a bird cam is a great idea. Okay, we'll get you. Your, we'll get you your bird cam going. I'm reading the chat. I'm trying to read the chat. <laughs> <You're> nuts. <laughs>
but that's always been my thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Every time we stream, I'm always chasing birds. Yeah. I've always wanted to chase birds. I'm trying to chase birds. <laughs> and they're beautiful. Yeah, everybody's going to have to get extra seat belts. And <laughs> yeah. Like a five-point harness. Okay. You're not on my screen, not right? Not yet, no. Okay, good. Oh, oh you yeah. Are. Yeah, go ahead. Because I'm going to go this way just in case I get lucky and get that big, Hold big on. bird. We're not uh, not shutting off yet. She's going to see if she can find a bird real quick. <laughs> that, but the problem is the sun's right there. Mm, you're all right. Picture looks good. Except I'm in most of it. I get really excited because there was, instead, not the usual little ones that I always see, there was a bigger one mm. that was red. Mm -hmm. I mean, it was like a dove size, not the little um, finches size. Birdie. Better luck next time, I guess. Mm hmm. Well, you gave it a good shot. We'll get you a camera Most set up. Most of the times, when you're not paying attention, and you have, when we were on the other side, you would take off mm -hmm. on your walks, and that's when I go bird hunting. But here, it's a little different. It's um, too hard to swing it around complete circle because our backs are to the trees. Mm -hmm. All right, that's it. All right. No birdies. Don's gonna take some scuba lessons. He's got that pool. Don, good idea. All right, this is really it. Yeah, frames dropped. No, oh, no that's zero. zero. Okay, good. I'm reading the wrong thing. Mm -hmm. I guess that's it. That's it? You had your fun? Yeah, I tried. I tried. We're going to get her the bird cam going. <laughs> and I'll bring the big long cable so I can move you over so you can spin your 360s. Yeah. Because yeah, here you're stuck on the wall. That's why I can't move the cameras to go where my eyes go. Right, right. <laughs> I love that. That's my favorite part. Wee, oh, wee. God. All right. Listen right there. She's nuts. Oh, butterfly. <laughs> Have a good weekend, everybody. Aloha. Aloha. <laughs> Thank you.